Hi, I'm Erin Scott Williams, and I am an alumnus of Michael E. DeBakey High School for Health Professions, the greatest class, class of 1997. And because of my wonderful experience here at DeBakey, I'm thankful and blessed to be an associate professor at Baylor College of Medicine, and I practice pediatric anesthesiology at Texas Children's Hospital. Hi, my name is Mahek and I'm currently a senior at DeBakey High School. Did you guys have rotations in your uh, years or like when you were a junior or senior? Absolutely, we had rotations and I believe you're referring to rotations in the hospital. Yeah. We loved our rotations, we did. I guess one per particular rotation that I enjoyed, I think, um, was actually allowing me to go to Texas Children's and that's where I am now. And so I would say your experience during your rotations greatly matters. What major did you choose in college? I was biology. I, I was not one of those majors that was completely different from medicine, um, but that doesn't mean you have to be a biology major. I chose, you... I chose biology too. Oh, okay. I think <laughs> that's a good thing. But if you choose or if you wanted to do something that's not biology, that's also fine. I have encountered many medical students that have had the honor of teaching and they're amazing medical students. They did not do a biology major. In fact, they did not do a science major. And so if there's something that's a passion of yours that you really want to major in, beyond biology, that's that's totally appropriate. But I chose biology, I enjoyed it. It was something that fueled my knowledge for medical school, fueled my knowledge for the MCAT, and I enjoyed it. So it sounds like you enjoyed it as well. So yeah. I'm glad. What are you interested in? Um. So at first, like when I started high school, I wanted to be, like I was set on being a neurosurgeon but then learning about like going through DeBakey, like it kind of gave me an experience of like, not exactly, but med school. And then I realized how difficult like that process might be. So then I want to do something like um, a dermatologist or something. So yeah, the, that's completely changed for me. That happens to, I would say 99.9% .9 of us. Okay. When I was your age um, and I came into DeBakey, I honestly thought that I would love to become a pediatric ophthalmologist and that's not what I do. Uh, and that's not because I just decided not to. It was just that the experiences that we have throughout our medical education, it'll guide you uh, to choose the specialty that is your passion. And so pediatric ophthalmology is wonderful, but my passion is pediatric anesthesiology. And so the fact that you've changed or you think that you might change your mind is totally normal. I just wanted to ask, is there any one experience that you can pinpoint that caused you to want to become a physician? Well, actually there is. Um, so like a few years ago, um, my dad passed away from a, a heart attack and that's actually the main reason why I decided I was like, yeah, this, I wanna become a doctor. Cause when I was like in, like we, um, we're visiting the hospital like day and night and all and I realized how the doctors were like, you know, trying to help in every way and all and like, like they were also comforting the family and I was like, yeah, I think that's what I want to do as well and I want to help out the people. And then especially when I came to DeBakey and like we got to um, see like the different fields and all, after that too I was like, yeah. I'm so sorry to hear about your dad, but what's a, a beautiful thing is that your drive to become a physician will be fueled by your dad's memory and everything that you love about him. And so it's a personal decision that no one else can take from you. And so now you're you're set. And all of us, I want you to remember that your personal story is what makes you. We all have that. Don't be afraid to share it. And I have my own personal story and that's, that's really what I wanted to know more about because no one can tell that story like you. Because of your experience, you will be a better physician. Thank you. And, that, and that's one thing for sure.